I'm back with my boyfriend, Eric. Sometime oh earlier in the summer, we did a video together where we tried like weird foods that I brought back from Costa Rica. But I told you I was gonna stop talking about Costa Rica, so today we're gonna talk about sodas. Cola, soda, pop, coke, whatever your colloquialism is and wherever you live. Yeah, we're trying them, yes. and they're weird. They are weird. So, yeah, we got these from this really cute little shop in a town where we live called Rocket Fizz. I think there might be more than one of them. Yeah, there's definitely one in California. Yeah, they're like, yeah, I've seen a couple other YouTubers from like LA do stuff like this. So they sell like soda, it's, it's called a soda pop and candy shop, I think is what it's mm -hmm. called. It's really cute, it's like 50 style. If you have one in your town, you should totally go to it. Not sponsored though, I just yeah. really think it's really cute. <laughs> but yeah, I had this idea to try the really weird sodas because we've been looking for a reason to try the, uh, the ranch dressing. <laughs> The ranch dressing is going to be our downfall. It says, y'all get your fixins. Wow, okay. I don't know. Um, so yeah, right. we discovered when reading the labels on these that pretty much all of these, except for this one right here, was made by Rocket Fizz. So they make their own sodas. But anyway, I don't want to spoil, I don't want to like go over what we're going to try because I don't want to spoil it. So let's just go ahead and start with the ranch since okay. they already know yeah, we're going to try that one. Right. So number one, ranch. Yeah, so we're going to start with the... Ranch dressing. It's uh, I guess they like they do like a faux brand for each of these because this one says yeah. says Lester Spixins. So yeah, I think all of these are twist top. So I'm just gonna twist the top. Twist the top. Whoa, it smells. I don't know. Uh, it smells like faintly like ranch dressing. Yeah. Sorry first. <laughs> Try first. It's your video. <laughs> it's good. Really? I think so. It's kind of sweet. You don't like ranch very well, so I'm really surprised. It doesn't taste like ranch. It's sweet. It almost tastes like like butterscotch. Oh, I don't like it at all. <laughs> no, <laughs> I do not like that. <laughs> the ranch dressing is going to be our downfall. Mm. I don't know. It tastes like butterscotch with a weird aftertaste to me. It's definitely it have a weird like aftertaste. Mm. Next. Next up, this one is the one that wasn't made by Rocket Fit. Always ask for Avery's. I guess it's just Avery's brand soda. And they have the um. Totally the, gross soda. I yeah, think it's, is the brand. it's and the bottom. The top. Yeah, it says it's so, so disgusting. disgusting, and uh, we love puns. So it's always uh, fun. But yeah, the um, it says fungal fruit, and right up here it says pink passion fruit and lime. So yeah, it's supposed other to be, than it's supposed to sound disgusting, but it's not actually going to be disgusting. Yeah, it was the weirdest flavor we could find because all the other ones were like bug juice, but it was like strawberry kiwi. Yeah. So passion fruit was like the weirdest thing we could Ooh, find. It smells like skittles. So I like it. Okay. Okay. That ranch out of your mouth. It's not bad. Yeah, I thought it was going to be sour, more sour than that. Yeah. Hang okay. it. Okay, I'm intrigued to try this one. So oh, okay. We're going to do Pete's Pumpkin Patch Soda. So yeah, it's Pumpkin Patch Soda. We were joking. We don't know if it's actually going to taste like pumpkins or just dirt. Pumpkin patch. Or grass. Yeah, it's like a scarecrow. <laughs> yeah, it tastes like a scarecrow. Whatever. Also, okay, this pure cane sugar. So yay. That's always good. I'm not good at it. That's why I've been using my shirt. I know. <laughs> and it still hurts my hands. Oh. Oh, but we might need we may need to use a bottle opener for this one. No, let's get a can opener. Bottle opener. Okay. Be right back. Okay, so let's uh let's try this again. Okay, I did it, finally. <laughs> totally not without a can opener. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, but I'm not lying there, I totally didn't use a can opener. Anyways, do you wanna try it first? Or? Yeah, I okay. picked it. Spicy. Like it smells like oh, yes. but yeah, some cinnamon in there or something. Hmm. It may not be a bad thing. Let's, let's see. I like it. Hmm. It doesn't taste like pumpkin though. It tastes like fall. 
It tastes yeah. like what um, cinnamon candles smell like. Yeah. What's next? Uh, I want to try this one because I've been really intrigued by this. Yeah. It's the green tea locale soda. So if you're uh, looking for that green tea carbonation taste, and uh, you don't, don't want to still watching your figure. Yeah. <laughs> With a very specific checklist. Yeah. It smells like green tea. It does. It smells like, it smells like tea, matcha green so. tea. I mean, it, ta it tastes like carbonated green tea. I'm not. I don't know what I was expecting. And it did say lightly sweetened, so I can't be. I was kind of. I was gonna say yeah, I expected it to be a little sweeter. Yeah, it does taste just like straight up tea with carbonation. I thought. <laughs> anyway, I want to try this one. It's. Cucumber soda because I saw it in a video um, that Rosanna Pancino did, and apparently it was really good. And I thought it sounded super disgusting, so we're gonna see if she's right. <laughs> well, they, if I'm not mistaken, there's like cucumber Pepsi in Japan. Pepsi. That doesn't mean it's good though. That just true, means Japan makes weird flavored things. That's very true. That's very true. Smells like crayons. <laughs> You're right. Why? I was like, well, it smells. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, it does taste like refreshing. Because the bottle says revitalize yourself. And it does kind of like taste like cucumbers. Like cucumber, yeah. That is so But it's weird. not actually that bad. It does no, have it's... a play doughy crayon y aftertaste. Yeah, play doh. Play doh. That's yeah. better. All right. And last but not and least. Coup de gras. Chocolate soda. <laughs> when we bought it in the store, it had a really cloudy like, look to it. And now I, we refrigerated these. We refrigerated these. And now, I guess, since the refrigeration. It, it's not cloudy. Yeah, it looks I don't know more how like that happened. Beer. Yeah, it looks like root beer, like a like a thin root beer. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna open this and see. Your laundry is ready. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna open this. Wow, like that's chocolate? yeah, I like that. Ooh, yeah, it smells like chocolate syrup. Yeah. Not bad. It's fizzy AF. Mm -hmm. Like, what? So, anyway. Yeah, that's I like pretty it. good. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, we tried weird sodas. Woo! Mm -hmm. So, which ones do you think we'll actually finish? Um, chocolate for sure. I'd finish, I mean, I'd finish all of them just slowly. The chocolate will get finished pretty quickly. Probably these two. Yeah, these two are okay. I am never drinking this again. I'll finish that one. This one was, in my opinion, the worst. I could not take it. The other one's pretty good, but mm -hmm. it tastes like Play Doh. Yeah, so that's it's weird. Weird. It's weird. But and yeah. The, the green tea one was. It could have been sweeter. Yeah. So yeah. But yeah, it was. Yeah, this was, this was a thing that happened. So, um. Thanks for watching. You should definitely check out Eric's channel. Sean Eric is his voice channel, and then Eric's Arcade is his gaming channel. He just started this cool series. Yeah, so it's ABCD, the Alpha Beta Creation Demonstration, where I go through um, and I look, I try to search for like alpha, games that are still in alpha and beta, and but they're released to the public for public play and stuff, and I play them and uh, see if they're any good, and hopefully to raise any sort of awareness to them. Yeah, you know, jump start the create, jump starts the developer into making it. If I can get them to be like, whoa, people are playing this, maybe I should continue doing it. Yeah, it's really cool if you're like into like indie games and stuff like that, like smaller scale stuff. <laughs> so you should definitely check those out, and you should subscribe to him, and you should subscribe to me because yeah, 
I post videos every Wednesday, so if you want updates on my videos and stuff, just subscribe and follow me on my social media. And yeah, if you liked this, you should give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. If you've tried any like weird sodas like this, or if you think we should do another video like this, trying weird candies or sodas or anything else like that, yeah, let us know. Or if you have a Rocket Fizz in town and you're like, yo, there's this really weird flavor that I have in my Rocket Fizz, you guys should try it. Yeah, I'm really curious about like how many Rocket Fizzes yeah, there are. Yeah, there you honestly. go, and that's another question. Because literally like three weeks ago we thought it was a small chain and then all of a sudden it's like, there's apparently one in LA, what is happening? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah, let us know. Other than that, thanks for watching, I love you guys, bye.